Welcome back to Arkham, or welcome, I'm sorry, this is the first video. Welcome to Arkham Reactor. I'm Leviathan. I'm Big and G. Is, and he's Big G. And we're two Scottish metalheads just going to react to some music, but I'm the Nightwish fan here. Nightwish. And Big G has only really seen Taya when it comes to Nightwish. So what we're going to do is we're going to take G on a wee tour through Flo Jansen. A wee However, tour through Flair. A wee tour through Flair. <laughs> uh, but the, the way this is going to work, Big G has a pick once a week. I have a pick maybe once or twice a week, depends on how the, the videos do upload. But Big G's turn, my turn, etc, etc. Mm -hmm. But what we're going to do today is the the one that seems the most popular for people getting introduced to Flair. And it is Ghost Love Score, which was originally a Taya song. So this is done live at Wacken. Are you excited, awesome. Big G? I am, yeah. Because, like you said, I've only really heard Tarja, Tarja, whatever you want to call her. She's fantastic, that's all I know. She, 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 Tarja's fantastic, yeah. Yeah. And when you hear floor, you... In fact, I'm just going to keep my mouth shut. Cause... Am I going to be floored? Sorry, Nightwish fans, you've probably heard that so many you will times. Be, you will be floored. Okay. If, I, if you're not floored by the end of this, I'll give you a thousand quid. Fair dues. And that and that's a bit that at the moment I don't I don't get paid till Friday, but I'm willing to put that on it. I need to hydrate before this just in case I end up drooling too much, or you end up falling off your chair, which yep. would be hilarious. So, Big G, whenever you're ready, count this I am ready. So, we are going in three, two, one, go. Oh, this gets me chills every day. Because I can run a synthetic tone out now. Mm -hmm. Band bonding there. Nice bit of friendship, I. Just hitting that note spot on. That is perfect. Absolutely. Lordy, lordy, lordy. 
Now that is just a wee part what Floor can do, but as you see, um, keyboardist has the big pipes. I like to say that rep- represents Floor's pipes. <laughs> she has some set of pipes on her. She's she's not even trying. This no, is just it's... the way the way this song previously went was um, Taya had all the opera part in it, right? And Floor was like, "I can do it, but I can also put my own twist on this." Yeah, and she's and it's totally different to if you go back to the release, the kind of the re, the an album for the. I think it was 20th anniversary or something like that. Uh, throughout the decades, it was called, I think, um, if my mind serves me right. And they have the tire version, I believe, on it. Right, so they did, f- they did record it with her? The, record, the, the original song is Tires, but I think there's a, there's a few live albums on Spotify as well that has this version on it. And I think this version now is the most popular version of Ghost Love Score when it comes to it. be interesting to compare the two because... As I said, I'd only ever heard Tarja, Tarja, or whatever you want to call her. Mm. Um, but I will say this, Fleur has some voice on her. Absolutely flawless. She does. It's literally most every video or song I've heard has pretty much been near enough pitch perfect. And the next song that we'll do as well will be, she does does a I'm not going to really spoil it, but there's a bit where it should only be um, that the kind of backing track that does the song, but she joins in and she just goes with it as well. There's, there's a change, there's a kind of chord change that she does as well. I think it's in the third line or something, and it's just at the end of the, end of the line, and it gives it a kind of Middle Eastern feel. Just the way, yeah. she, just the, mm-hmm. the way she kind of takes the note up just like mm. a half tone it goes up but it's absolutely beautiful she, she does she can change from obviously as you know singers can do what's it um, what is, do they call it face voice they call it like front voice or something full voice like, uh, you, uh, you get the, the full voice you get oh, right hang on you get fry which is the the gravel vibrato is a wobble um, mm-hmm. I know what you're talking about. It's it's head head voice and head voice. Like, yeah, head voice. Uh, head you were right. You were right the first time. It is head voice. She, does, she likes and and this she does a lot of kind of mixing, which people say is dangerous. But she yeah, just if you're it. trained, if you're trained and you're breathing properly. I'm I'm a vocalist myself, by the way. Um, if you're trained well enough, you can you can go between. Pretty much no, but he... any style, so long as you're breathing properly and you are hydrating. Yes, but most people say that when it comes to like vocal coaches and things like that, it's kind of hard to get the kind of right balance between the two and put them mm-hmm. both together at the same time and output them. But yeah. she does it. She does it flawlessly. But and you can't even talk. hear her. You can't even hear like the a difference in power between mm-hmm. the head voice and actual full voice. Anyway, Just... as you were saying, let's let's get on with it. The Nightwish fans are going to be so pissed at us if we don't. Let's do yeah. this. Three, two, one.
just everything that's this that's like more like a like an opera. This has like several parts to it. Mm-hmm. That, that bit was more the, the start bit was obviously the kind of uh, and kind of what was the word I'm looking for again? It's more kind of on the higher scale. This one's just the more kind of calmer. And right, then, this is kind of almost like a bridge. It's not uh-huh. quite a solo either. It's more kind of the guitar's more more, just, more echoing what what she was just doing vocally. So it's not technically yeah, a solo. It's like a, it's kind of like a, a a wee story without the obviously the words. Mm-hmm. Just giving Didn't me a wee bit of back. The whole thing's kind of Celtic sounding, or Nordic, Nordic Celtic, very similar. As they are Finnish uh, from Finland, I would represent that. They have that kind of influence as well, but I think they take influence from all different parts. When you get the new album, you the very new album that was released, I think it was May last year. You'll see all different different types of influences in it. Right. But there's a there's a wee kind of just we play. Three, two, one, go. Very good. <laughs> Look in his eye, he's got something in his eye. I'm not crying. I'm, you're crying. I'm something not crying. in my eye. It's a bit of grit. Someone's hair I'm went not... in my eye when they were moshing. <laughs> I'm not crying. is coming. Fucking dirty. Just that that little bit of gravel in the voice there just just gives it a bit of it's, it's just as as well as the it's the change. It just goes and you're like And that little operatic bit just at that just at the beginning of that darker turn there. It was very, <laughs> very Kate Bush actually. That's what it reminded me of vocally. It was like Kate Bush. You know, when she used to go really, really high. It's a bit before your time, Kate Bush. I don't know if you'll remember her. No, it's just a joke about Kate Bush. What? It's just a joke about Kate Bush. Oh, right, okay. Um, I'll pretend I know what you're talking about, because I don't. I'll, I'll tell you later. All oh, right, okay. Fair <laughs> news. That whole section's just what I call dirty. I mean, dirty meaning good, but well, 
No, I don't you mean fantastic, but that was nasty. I hate that when you're going to sneeze and then nothing happens. <laughs> Anywho, yeah, phenomenal. Very operatic, and I really want to see Nightwish live now, and I'm regretting all the times that I could have and didn't. Uh, but no, who would you go see? I'll ask you this in a few weeks, but when we've done th- through more, but well, like, like I said, I've only ever heard are you so, but no, haven't heard, uh, haven't heard just in the basis of this one song so far. I'd rather go and see Fleur. As you can see, the board, the band's more together when, when they were tired. They were at the start, if we're kind of by the end, you seen that we're all standing to say prettily apart and things like that. And I well, suppose by now, by this point, they're kind of more accomplished musicians and they're masters uh, of their art by this point, you know. Well, when you when when usually the title of uh, Symphonic Metal comes ahead to is usually the f- in the first two names is a uh, Nightwish and what's it? Who else is it again? I can't remember. Dream Theater. I would <clears throat> say yeah, but then there's the, always the other one of um, Sonic Arca or whatever the name is as well. They get mentioned a lot, and then Within Temptation, another one right there. Well, Within Temptation, kind of. I don't no, know. I it, it, it's not my cup of tea, but um, this is two sugars, please. <laughs> Same. I don't take sugar in my tea, but in my coffee, I'll take two. Bark, anyway, anyway, right. enough jabbering. Who's counting? Last down? stretch to go. I'll go this time. Three, two, one. Uh, we better shimmy shimmy there. That's probably the least bit of the Caribbean. Yeah. I'm in love.
لا بقى حسيت You have sir, just been floored. Give me a second here. <laughs> She's an Amazon. She is an the queen Amazon. Of she is an Amazon, Amazonian goddess. You've just been floored. That. That last note that she held was just absolutely perfect. I think she could have done it. I'm more than sure Flo could have done it a little bit longer, but if, if you... It was just enough. It was just enough, though. It was like, I can hit this note. I can keep it going, but I'm not going to milk it. You know, it was just... Um... I'm not going to over, not even overdo it, just I'm not going to extend this anymore. This is just enough for that effect that I'm looking for. That was absolutely stunning. Oh, sir, you have so much more to come. The Queen of Metal has you right by the box. You can keep them. <laughs> she she can she can have them any time she wants them. Floor if you ever want them, <laughs> they're right here for you. <laughs> I think she'd rather have the, her husband's the drummer of um, Sabatons. But... That's fine. That's fine. Do you know something? My my fiance would absolutely agree, and she would probably want to join in if she ever saw that and heard that. Uh, that. <laughs> Let's start because we'll be here for about 20 minutes. <coughs> what? It says if we start laughing, we'll be here for about 20 minutes. Aye, aye, right, okay. So, mm. yeah, that was that was incredible. Back to you, sir. I'm going to shut up. So, next video, we're going to do some um, night wish, and I think we'll go along the road of story time because that's usually what I'd recommend, secondly. And then I think we'll go to Amaranth. And then we'll let the people decide because they obviously have their own personal choices that they'll want heard as well. So Amaranth, I think, after. But I think you like story time. It's a little bit, it's a lot different. It's obviously that was wrote for Annette, which was the middle singer. Right. And she had a lot more pop kind of influence but Flores just went this was an ex song oh I can do this with it and she's oh, it's, made, it's it, made it her own again every song in this in this tour she she'd only joined the band for she hadn't even joined them fully she was just like a kind of this obviously the singer left and she came in as a replacement and she had to learn 24 songs in something like 48 hours there's a video on it as well she learned 24 songs in Night Wishes and she just came in altered them all, made them her own and this was one of the last tours as well of that tour before, because I think they finished in Germany they had done the whole world, they were, the singer left when they were in America, so they had like the America, then they done like South America and I think they went on to China and things like that as well mm -hmm. and then back to Europe so she had only been with them for like a few months and after the thing was done they just went we want you. I would have as well. Just based based on what she's done there. I mean, if she if she came in, just even to fill in for somebody and done that, I would have just been like, no, do you want this? This job's yours. Anytime you that's, want. That's 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 pretty much what it was because the Camelot singers came in, tried it. At, they're done not bad, but by the fourth came in, she was just like that. The weird the thing is as well. Room. The weird thing is as well. Like I've heard people saying that he was. He was. I know she's different to what Tarja does. You know, she's. She does. She's got her own style as well. But I've heard people saying, you know, uh, Tar Tarja's still always going to be the best. Flair's just a lesser, a lesser vocalist. But you can't say that. She's phenomenal. She is phenomenal. Yeah. 
there's you can in a way you can compare your own favourites. You will have your own personal preference. You're always but, going to have your favourite, yeah. Absolutely. Yeah, but at the end of the day, both if you can if you take an out of it, both of them in their own right have our night wish at the end of the day. I don't yeah. think Ty will ever return, but I think maybe Maybe the band will probably end when they do get through time before, which is what I hope. Yeah, go out in a high. So, we're gonna do some. Well, we are gonna we, do some Avatar next on the next one. I'm not telling after. you what one. Mm-hmm. It's gonna be good. So, we've, so we've got Keith Morrow. Right? Mero. So we're Mero. gonna we're gonna Mero. Keith Morrow. We're Mero. gonna do Keith Morrow. Then we're gonna to go to oh, I forget the name every story time. Then we'll do some after. So stick your night wish suggestions and all your other metal suggestions down below. Yep. And comment and subscribe. Yep. And like. And share. And, like. and share the button too. Share. Sharing's caring. But apart from that, I'll see you in the next one. And so will I. Bye.